Hello, this is DTJ with another video for you. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Like and subscribe, I have almost 150 helpful videos for you. So today we find ourselves in Jigoku Dani Yain Koen, also known as Snow Monkey Park in Nagano, Japan. We finally parked and now we will start walking the trail to see those darn monkeys. Parking is free, but You'll want to bring some snow socks just in case you have to slip them on to get out of the parking area. It really all depends on your vehicle. I have all wheel drive and even I still have a pair in the back for emergencies. Uh, there was this one guy that was spinning so crazy it took him about three minutes and a push to get him going. So keep that in mind. It's the little things people don't tell you that will get you in the end. Also, there's a cafe here called the Enza Cafe. I recommend going there after coming back down the trail because you will most certainly be famished. It is a hike, and I would say it takes about 30 minutes up and 30 minutes back at a normal pace. It's a little bit longer for us because we have small children, which you can bring, but for obvious reasons, don't bring a stroller. Don't even think about it. It won't fit and it's not safe. A sling or something like that, like an ergo baby for the little ones and some decent snow boots and you're fine. I'm wearing an ergo baby right now, actually, <laughs> my smallest child. And I've been up this trail before and being from Philadelphia, I have the most experience out of the group walking on ice. Let's go. You can make a snow angel on the way down, okay? Over there, somewhere clean. <laughs> Good boy. Good job. Come on. Ooh, look at you. <laughs> Someone called a taxi up his neck. Yay! Snow monkeys! Whoops, excuse me. Of course. Taking a bath. Yeah, I need help. Up we go. Watch your step. Hold on, grab something. All right, let's walk, come on.
Let me know when you see your first monkey. Cause sometimes you'll see them along this trail. They'll come up here. Sometimes you'll see them down there too.
Watch your step. Look at feet. Yeah, I see. I <laughs> That's why you need your hat on. Walk slowly, like a penguin. <laughs> nice it though. Mm -hmm. Don't hit my don't hit my camera. Okay, okay. Right my leg, okay. Oh you got me. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> you got me out. Mm. Okay, let's walk. Oh, let me get my. My name. It's okay. You can walk in the mud safer, huh? Mm. We're not 
not even halfway. Uh, no, we're halfway. Let me put this bottle in your backpack real quick. Come right behind you. And thank you. Just get in front of you, so if you need me, just call me. I'll be right there.
Slippery. Very slippery, says. Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> Someone actually fell down on the trail and couldn't get up. I edited that out for their privacy, but they were grimacing with pain, I am telling you. I felt for them, but I couldn't help them for obvious reasons. I had my hands full. Which brings me to my next point. You have to be physically fit to walk this trail. It's for your own safety, trust me. They can get a medical team up to you, but it will take some time depending on where you are on the trail. It took over 90 minutes for the one guy to actually get put in the ambulance. We saw him coming down, then saw them driving behind us after we actually left the Enza Cafe after eating for about an hour. You okay? Cool. Walk in the dirt, it's safer. Nastier, but safer. Sometimes the monkeys do come up on the trail and try to get food from you. I'd advise that you do not do that. <laughs> That'll just bring more of them. I saw that the last time I came here, about three years prior. One of them yanked food out of a toddler's hand and he didn't even <laughs> offer it to him. So other than that, they're peaceful and they're used to being around humans. You do not have to fear them. Don't get no more out the house than this. If you did, this park wouldn't be open in the first place. This trail is narrow, so take your time to walk carefully so you can get there and back in one piece. these boots down before they get in the car. Mm-hmm. 
a little further than I uh, remember. Pick them up. Come on. A little further than I remember. What's that? Oh. Excuse me. Yeah, I know, right? Oh. Want to pick him up? Right, come on. You do, then I do. Sure. For a few, few mm. minutes, then. Take turns. Mm. So we never get there. Nope. Why are you always doing this? Shh, shh, shh. Shh, shh, Be careful when the monkeys come out, don't pull the monkeys are here, don't pull the chips out. <laughs> we there, where there's running water, there's life. Yes. Huh? Because yeah. you've been walking? Yeah. Come on, girls. <laughs> Having fun, girls? Yeah. Mm. Yo, my Yes, sir. The work must be put in daily, as you know. there yet you okay good
Don't be like daddy. No angels, anyone? <laughs> There is a fee for entering the actual area with a You can also see adult humans and a nearby onsen once you get to the top. <laughs> you got an aerial view of them and they're kind of butt naked, so be ready for that. Cover your kids' eyes uh, if you have to.
Oh man, I came all the way over here to see this monkey's ass. <laughs> Did you know I drove four hours from Kanagawa, Kansas to get here? Oh, that was a trip, let me tell you. And they are scrapping, they are fighting like crazy over here. All around you, they're fighting. There's also a live feed going on, so you can look at them anytime, but I can't speak to its reliability. That's why it's better to just watch my video. That's just me though. And that is Jugokudani Yan Cohen or Snow Monkey Park. Come here, but be ready to walk and walk carefully. Like and subscribe. I'm DTJ. Thanks for watching. DTL.